put onto the bridge. Yeah. And and it, this was cordoned off it's nearly sadly, 12 months yes. ago, absolutely. And people couldn't get to the houses because of the explosion. The explosion was horrific, as you know. Debris everywhere, windows blown out. And so it was devastating for the neighbors, for the community. But the anniversary coming up soon, and 12 months on, as we go under the bridge, we're going to just have a look to see what work has been done. And to be fair, the council did do a, a clear up of the road. As regards to the buildings, not much has been done, as we will see. Now, the contractors have moved into our Grade 2 listed buildings, but again, quite slow, but they, they, they have started on the roofs, as we'll see in a moment. And these are these coming on the right. Yeah, they? that's Obviously, right. Obviously, as we get closer, they were more and more affected. And they are, this is the edge of Port Sunlight. It is, yeah. The, 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 the listed village. So, so we're coming up to it now. We're gonna see what, what's happened nearly a year on. So as we can see, to the right, the scaffolding up there, there's my house. Uh, no slates on the roof on that side. And then there's the terrace. Demolition of one yeah, yeah, there. yeah. That, that's yeah. Some, some still that's there. right. This is, we'll go round again. Yeah. We'll go round again and have a look. But we go, go right here. But you see the boards in the window are still there in that case. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, it was affecting right out to here mm. because obviously this is all the edge of Port Sunlight Village now. So. Absolutely. And I think some of the questions which are going to be asked is why it's taken so long. Um, as you said before uh, in an interview, that the government didn't step in last year, which was horrific for us because, you know, when Grenfell happened in the Manchester Arena, they were terrible, terrible. And you know yourself, you visited Grenfell. Yes, did, yeah. uh, and I think the problem is people are worried because they just haven't been that quick to step in and help New Ferry. Uh, rightly so, they were right to help Grenfell, they were right to help Manchester. Uh, but two, here, we've had problems as well. So now we'll stop here and we'll have a look. On the next boat we'll have a look, have a little walk around and see, you know, close up how things are now. <laughs> 